Are new routines during quarantine giving your child anxiety? Do they seem overwhelmed by their feelings about the pandemic? Do they talk about being scared for what might happen in their future? Welcome to From Our Family to Yours, where we share relatable stories and helpful advice from community members like you. Hi, I'm Jerry from the Understood Team. This week's story revolves around helping your child remain calm even during times of uncertainty and comes from Understood Community member Rochelle in Baton Rouge, Louisiana. She writes, My son Charles has had a hard time during this pandemic. We have been challenged with trying to help him understand what's going on and adjust to the whole new world. Charles likes to do activities outside the house with family, not being able to go anywhere for a long time and then being restricted once things did open up has taken a toll on him. He doesn't fully understand what is happening and keeps asking, when will all of this be over? It seems to trigger both stress and anxiety. Charles likes plans and schedules. Unfortunately, there's no planned or scheduled end date for this pandemic. Well, Rochelle, it seems like uh, Charles is having a particularly difficult time because it's difficult for him to understand what's going on in the world around him. It's difficult for all of us to understand what's going on. But when kids are challenged by uh, comprehension difficulties, uh, making sense of new and strange things is especially difficult for them. So I think it's important to keep the messages that you're sending to him, uh, very concrete, not simplistic, but simple. Rochelle continues by saying, we have used videos made for children to help explain what's happening, but still we face the same questions weekly. All of the extra cleaning and sanitation at home and wearing masks when we leave the house makes Charles a bit anxious. He worries now and that wasn't a big issue before. He is learning virtually and it's his senior year. It's definitely not what we envisioned. He is a lot more anxious and clingy. He worries about everyone when they leave the house and doesn't let me get out of his sight. He has so many questions about how and what he is supposed to do when he graduates. The fear of this pandemic has made my son resolve to just stay at home after he graduates. Well, Rochelle, I can certainly understand his desire to just stay at home because all of this anxiety has made the world outside of our home a very anxious place. This is a problem for a lot of parents whose kids are facing this transition into young adult life. It's a new frontier for all of us. But for kids who have found comfort in being at home and the regularity and predictability and the love and care that they feel there, uh, it makes this transition a very difficult time. If it's not too soon to think about it, having Charles imagine what the world outside might be like, uh, maybe reading stories from other kids who have ventured out into this new territory of life beyond high school, whether it's to more education or to a work environment, that might be helpful to him as well. We like to say and understood you're not alone and Charles is not alone either. There are hundreds if not thousands of young men and women across the country uh, dealing with this issue of what life will be like, what what life beyond this protected environment of home will be like. This is a good time to prepare for that transition. So I wish you well in that. And I wish all parents well who are dealing with kids like Charles who are anxious about the world beyond this life we're living right now. If your child has also expressed concerns about their future, Feel free to share your story in the comments below and check out all of our From Our Family to Yours episodes for more helpful advice from the understood community. Until next time, this has been From Our Family to Yours. Thanks for watching.